The speed at which someone is breathing is a really useful indicator of whether they are unwell or not. A normal breathing rate or respiratory rate is between 12 and 20 breaths per minute. A respiratory rate above or below this range can be worrying. If someone who is on a strong painkiller such as morphine, breathing less than 10 times per minute can be significant. This may suggest that they have taken too much medication. And if someone is taking more than 25 breaths per minute, this is considered significant and is worrying. Some people with long-term lung conditions, such as COPD, may have a higher rate of breathing than others. In these people, it is important to spot a change from their normal breathing rate. The key to getting an accurate measure of someone's respiratory rate is not to let them know that you are counting their breaths. This is because once someone becomes aware of their breathing, they may start breathing faster or slower than normal. To measure someone's respiratory rate, ensure the person is comfortable in their chair or bed. Watch their chest rise and fall as they breathe in and out. Measure how many breaths they take over a full minute to rule out irregular breathing patterns. You can use a stopwatch or an electronic device to count one minute while you are counting the breaths. Finally, record the respiratory rate in the notes. Once you've counted the respiratory rate, you need to document it on the paper news chart or your electronic record. Be aware that people tend to breathe a little more slowly when they are asleep and can breathe more quickly when they are agitated or in pain. You will still score them the same on the news chart. You should seek help if their respiratory rate is not normal for them. Even if their overall news isn't high, if you're worried about someone's breathing, you need to speak to a senior colleague or your manager.